We've shot the whole thing almost like a 10 hour movie. It's a tapestry that has been seen from the beginning through to the end and things are laid in throughout the whole thing. Every single character in it has a really rich world to explore and is full of drama and conflict. I'm not leaving this circus until I learn everything you have to teach. As far as I'm concerned, you're only here to keep the lights on and from the looks of things, you're not even doing that very well. Algernon has this one obstacle after another. It starts with Thackeray not wanting to be there and then Gallinger who insists that he not even be allowed in the surgical theater. As my grandmother used to say, a hell of a road to hope. <laughs> Your role is to talk Gallinger through the procedure. Nothing more. They're not afraid of really dealing with the reality of what it would have been like for this African-American man living in this time and in this particular scenario. We go right into the center of it. Edwards, what's next? We don't have time for your Nick games. Beyond his quite evident racist tendencies, Gallinger very much feels that Edwards has stolen his job and is not fit to be in this hospital. What do you think you're doing? Reading his chart. Surely there's no harm in that. There's harm in everything you do. He honestly believes he's a better surgeon. What becomes harder to deal with is when he realizes that he isn't. So I suppose we won't be needing your expertise any longer. I suppose not. A lot of characters get a lot of stuff happen to them that is pretty shocking. I have seen some crazy bad shit, sister. But the look in that girl's eyes, that was too much. Nurse Harriet and he uh, start out on a bit of a tricky ground. Mr. Cleary, I need a moment. That's all it usually takes me. They find their goals line up when it comes to helping people. And they end up in business together, not voluntarily on Harriet's part. There is money to be made here, sister. And I don't intend to leave it for anyone else. He does a lot of good things for bad reasons. From now on, you split your earnings, 60-40. Tilted my way. I mean, as much as they are about the breakthroughs in modern medicine, the scripts really confront issues that haven't been resolved in society today. In 10 years, she could be running the whole hospital. In 10 years, I expect to have a gaggle of grandchildren. I hope she understands that when she's married, she'll have other responsibilities. The thing that Captain Robertson and Cornelia's mother haven't factored in is that actually Cornelia is someone who doesn't just want to be a housewife. She wants to do something useful. What is it? Typhoid fever. Anything you need from the hospital or my family, please let us know. Each episode just emotionally piles on top of the other one. It's kind of intense. You're just standing there! Help him, goddammit! The surgeries are flooring. You're gonna be shocked. I mean, there are things that are gonna happen that you're gonna be like, they pulled out what? I don't handle blood so well, so I don't know how I'm gonna cope watching it. The sex and the violence and the death, all of that represent the harshness of New York at the time. And what happens is really wild.